Okay, so now I guess I got kind of far for the first death. I just made a bad choice, that's all. That tends to happen when you're under pressure by creepy looking ugly ass hand things. Like, what is that? Like, what? what is that? It's hands, man. It's dead hand. It's straight up dead hand. Following me from my childhood. It knows. Okay, so I'm gonna try to use the Murakumo on these dudes because... It, I can... Oh, there's a door over here? Oh, man. I didn't know there was a door over here. Uh, be... Oh, okay. It's... <laughs> uh, because I can stun lock them with the Murakumo. Alright. Let's, uh... Let's check this other door out. Oh, no! He's got back up. Did I love how they're coming out of the... Uh! Uh! God, they keep dying and I think they're alive. Okay. There, I love how they kind of come out of the snow, like, straight up like the Huns from Mulan or something. <laughs> Dance of fire. Oh, no. Is that the spell that the thing has been using? God, I hope not. Oh, no. It might be. Pyromancy created by Magus Eggy? That looks like a familiar name. Loyal follower of the old Iron King. Cast flame sweeping motion. Oh. Oh, it's that thing. I saw that in the Hellkite Drake video. That looked really cool. Oh, I'm looking for it. Like, the DLC spells look like a lot of fun. Actually, the DLC weapon, like the Puzzling Stone Sword from the uh, last one... Pretty cool weapon, too. So they've been giving us some pretty cool weapons. Is that uh, it for this room? Because you never know. Just just checking. Okay. Yeah, I'm just saying. Alright, let's see if I can... Ah, da, 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 da. Oh, it's someone like another... Oh, no, there's another one hiding. I didn't even like consider that for some reason. Uh-oh. Whoa! God damn it. Retreat. Tactical chug. Okay, bring it on. Go for the backstab. Yeah. Uh. How'd that feel? Okay, I can kill him in one hit with a backstab. That's nice to know. Okay, run. Run. I didn't. I like. I didn't even. I like. I wasn't even considering that more could pop out of the snow. So I gotta be wary of snow. Be wary of backstab. Yeah. Oh, like I'm always nervous to attack again when I'm that close to a cliff because sometimes I feel like it's going to knock me off. Wouldn't be the first time. Oh, yeah. Oh, this looks pretty cool. I like this. I'm digging this right now. Definitely got a uh, Majora's Mask Snowhead Temple. That's it. Snowhead. Got it. Knew it would come to me. Yeah, it's got that kind of vibe. I did, I, like as a child, that was one of the temples I didn't like. Kind of like in Ocarina of Time, I didn't like the water temple when I was a kid. But as I grew older, like now, it's actually probably one of my favorite temples, so. Probably, well, I don't know, I think Stonehenge was probably a better temple in that game. Water Temple's another thing, but. We're playing Dark Souls, which kind of has Zelda-ish elements. Actually, the first time I played Dark Souls, no joke, like I felt like it was a combination between RuneScape and Zelda, which were two of my favorite games, so. Naturally, I loved it. Uh, okay. Hello, spooky people. Who I'm sure won't grab me because that would be terrifying. Terrifying! Uh. Yeah. These guys are pretty cool though. The ones with the swords. I like their sword. It's, uh. uh. Oh, that's a cool halibird. Anyone else gonna sneak up on me and push me off the cliff? Like, all of a sudden, like, it cuts to a cutscene and patches is behind me. Like, good day, mate, and just pushes me off the edge. That would be so great. Illusionary wall ahead, but pointless. Well, obviously, I mean, like, if that wasn't, but pointless, you say? There is no such thing in Dark Souls as pointless, except maybe a room with nothing in it. And pointless is sort of subjective. To be honest with you guys, I'm still waiting for, uh, I was really had my fingers crossed for the DLC. I was hoping to see patches in the DLC, and I was hoping to see, uh, no joke, uh, I talked about this with Dusty, it would have been a really cool nod to FromSoft, with, I mean, FromSoft to us, uh, to have a Red Invader. Uh, I don't know what the name would be, but basically like the Giant's dad from Dark Souls 1. Like wearing the same stuff, but red, so you couldn't really quite tell, but he'd have his Wii Hand or like the Giant's mask. I thought that would have been really cool, like have a Red Invader for that in Dark Souls 2. God, that voice keeps spooking me out. I, I don't know. I just thought that was going to be like a really cool thing they could do. Try a ranged battle. With the door? Yes. Probably, actually, maybe. Be wary of fire. Okay, so... 
I, I was almost going to skip that comment as a, or message as a joke, but it's probably not. Uh, you know, I got an idea. Play things the safe way. Let's uh, swap that for, do I not have a fire ring? Okay, fire quartz ring. Oh shit. Are those walking barrels? Okay, no, there's things behind them. What the fuck? Dude, this DLC has some creepy enemies, like Silent Hill Dead Space up in here. Are they using the barrels? Are they explosive barrels? Hey, you can't hide back there. Well, those are explosive barrels. Oh yeah, they are. Yeah, I'm playing things the safe way. At least for most of them. What? Okay, I gotta let my stamina come all the way back. I'm not getting the full effect. Don't get near me. Don't you touch me. Dude, look how creepy that thing looks. Oh my god. This is awesome. <laughs> Best game ever. What do you think these were? Uh, oh, that's, that's pretty cool. Okay. What do you, do you think they were like hollowed workers here? I'm thinking probably. Ladder ahead. Really? Oh, there. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I already like this place more than I like the actual iron keep where we were. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Uh, woohoo! Okay, I gotta be wary of all these barrels, because... All it takes is one kamikaze, dude. Or many kamikazes. So many kamikazes. Maybe I should... Woo! Just let them kill themselves. <laughs> That's kind of awesome. Damn, what was that big guy? I didn't get to see him. Oh, this is, this is like... I like this architectural design already. This is kind of cool. Yeah, I already kind of like this more than I like the uh, Iron Keep. Anyone down here? Just some big dude with a big giant axe who is dead. Ha! Dark spear. Oh boy. Okie dokie. Thank you. Sometimes I feel like I just shouldn't read any of these because then I won't be as surprised, but you know. Alright, uh, let's, uh, I got some souls now, so I'm gonna throw on. I'm gonna throw this back on, but I'm gonna probably put on the, uh, easy mode ring. <laughs> ring of try again. And I'm going to buff my weapon because I'm pro. MLG bros. Uh-oh. I don't know what that was. Is he shooting shit at me? Oh, God. Ah, don't break the chest. Okay. It wouldn't be the first time an enemy tricked me into breaking a chest. I should have checked this. Okay. There hasn't been a... Ooh. Ooh. Plus eight, that's cool. They're giving us a lot of high plus weapons. They gave us a plus uh, whip in the last one, too. Interesting. And a bow. The bow is actually really useful on one of my characters. Uh, oh, wait, well, let's, let's not mess up that. Cool. Whoa, wait. Wait. These could all blow fire, couldn't they? This seems like a very dangerous place to be. I didn't see a dark... Wait, okay, I didn't see a dark spirit. That's kind of weird. Maybe they were lying. Or maybe. Do I have to be human? I don't have to be human in this one. No, I don't. Which I thought was a good addition. Uh, okay, we probably shouldn't open that right this second. What the fuck? What the fuck? Holy shit. That's a bow? What the fuck? It looks like a core. That's Oh my god. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> Do over. Now that guy is fighting something. Something horrible. Now I wonder, could that actually turn on fire? That would be really cool. <laughs> that would actually be really cool, like a death trap room. Alright. Doesn't uh of course it doesn't. We gotta go the long way. Through the creepy fog door. This could actually probably be a boss, I should be ready. No, okay. Well, like, the last 
last DLC like had two bosses like right after one another, and I don't think Dark Souls has ever done that before, and it kind of threw me off. But uh, yeah, I was uh, I might as well douse myself in water, right? I mean, why not? <laughs> but um, okay, that's a lift. This also a lift, maybe. Huh. Oh yeah, this is definitely got a... I know I keep saying it, but it's definitely got a snowhead vibe. Like, very much so. Ah, no! You bastard. Well played, motherfucker. Well played. I can't probably make it to that ladder. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. GG, bros. Okay. Uh, clutch mode, activate. Run! Climb the ladder! Climb it! Woo! Die! Uh, uh. What the fuck? Oh, the other barrels. Okay. Or maybe only some explode? I don't even know. That was a pretty good trap. See, that's what I wanted in the first DLC. Like, I wanted traps like that. Like, that was awesome. Okay. I, I kind of am. I haven't really played the whole thing yet. But this sort of is shaping up more to be, uh... Like, a more enjoyable... DLC, like, I liked the last one a lot. Like, the best thing about the last ones, hands down, was, uh, the bosses. Absolutely loved all the bosses. Yeah, some of them were a pain, like those three NPC dudes, but, like, Sin, the, the evil queen, I loved how she could summon backup. And, uh, those guys were certainly challenging. Uh, this, the DLC bosses for the last one were really good. So I'm hoping this one's equally as good. So far, I'm just really liking the level design and enemies. Like, a trap like that, that's classic. I love it. Okay. Is this going to get... Oh, my God. Yeah, now now I'm really getting a Snowhead Temple vibe because I remember doing that a lot, running around the locked doors. <laughs> Wondering what level the place should be at. Okay, so didn't I crawl down here and I fell down this trap? I Damn, what is that thing? Look at that thing. And then, like, the flesh thing is, like, turning them icy. I don't know if that's a buff or not. Try range battle. Hmm. Let's go back up. <coughs> Can I even Yay Okay Can I jump down from here? What I want to jump down I whatever. Huh. Uh, no, no Yeah. <laughs> Pretty long drop to the bottom. Who wants to bet the boss is near the bottom, too? At least one of them probably is. I'm expecting three bosses again. Okay, let's try that again, but, like, with a lot less fail. You know what I mean? And now that I'm wearing the ring, I should probably pop a... effigy in a very awkward spot. Yeah. Jump down? Yeah, okay. Is this... Wait, is this where I just was? Ah, shit. I think it was. Oh, my God. Yep, it is. Good thing I risked my life for absolutely no reason. Okay, seems like there was a path. Okay, this guy got me last time. That's what happened. This guy. What a dick. But do I have to go down there? Oh, man. It looks like I do. <laughs> I love how the trap door, like, resets. That's great. Oh, wait. What is this? A bunch of corpses? I don't buy it. They're not corpses, they're... Candy? Maybe? Oh, a door that opens. What do you know? Oh, this is to here. Okay. Jesus Christ. Okay. Don't do that. No to self. Bad idea. Very bad. Alright. Do I have to really... Oh my god, guys. This is like... If I had time to stick that into it. So wait, do I need to... I don't even need to use those. It just gives me the option to use it. Okay. Um, What are the odds an alluring skull help me out? I never use alluring skulls. What are the odds this will be the one time? Anybody? Oh yeah, there's a taker. We got a taker. I'm not so good at using these in my left hand. Ok, 
Okay, the magic is a lot more damage. That's good to know. Good. That's, that's at least one. I was hoping to get at least one. Any more? I mean, there are more little guys. Okay, let's kill that thing. We don't need that running around. Those fucking guys. <laughs> they might be a new favorite any of mine, though, because they're just like, I don't know, they're like kamikazes, and they're kind of like annoying, but they don't like directly attack you. Let's try one more luring skull. Try to chuck it. Nah, not close enough. Okay, I could pro if I could take out those two little guys, this could happen. Alright, good, good. Ah, no. No, no, no. Who's chucking stuff? This guy? Oh, what an asshole. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Is this a giant? Is it a headless giant? What the fuck? No. Uh, okay, let's go kill the archer. Okay, I don't know what that is, but I probably don't want to get hit by it. Okay, I think it's making them stronger. Ah, don't hurt me. I just want to kill you. Firebomb. Ooh, flame quartz ring plus three. Thank you. That is highly welcomed here. Well, he seems to be moving slower, actually. Oh, that's a cool concept. I just realized. Okay, let's say... Oh, God. That was half my life. Let's say the old Iron King based everything off of forging in flame, right? I mean, like, the flame is big. Just, I mean, it is in this game anyways, but, uh... But let's say the old Iron King was all about fire. Like, that was his thing. Like, fire buff everything. Basically, straight up like Gwen. I mean, because he is, like, the reincarnation of Gwen, all things, when it boils down to it. So, his, uh, like, his queen, if his queen is evil like all the other queens were, she would be ice. Ah, that's a cool idea. She would be all ice and stuff, so she would be freezing his soldiers. Oh, that's that's so cool. That that uh, thought process just crossed my mind. Although these things are using like black fire, so okay, die. Eat this. Uh. Yeah. Ah, they're so creepy, dude. Into ice. Okay, so I wonder is that whose side is that thing on? Dude, it's so spooky. It's very unlike Dark Souls. Okay, so another, so we should definitely be killing all of these because we're getting fragments of her soul. Yeah, okay. Alright, this is cool. I am digging this DLC so far. More than the last one, too. And I enjoyed the last one. So saying that, that I really enjoy this one more is saying something.